What's up, YouTube? Thanks for tuning back into Chase Games here. And today, uh, I'm going to show you uh, me taking down Blossom Door 31. Um, you can pause on that first screen if you want. Uh, go back all on your own. Um, the agility is not really tough to hit here, but it could matter for you. Um, I don't remember if any of these guys had agility gear on them. And I just did this like a half hour ago. So that's how shit my memory is. Um, anyway, I want to preface. This is a step-for-step -step copy of Pen Pen, whose video will be linked in the description. His video had a couple of crits, although they seem to be inconsequential. But uh, you'll see that uh, if you look at our videos, uh, my I've got some different ranks, some different awakenings. I'll get crits in different places or not at all. So um, I figured it would help to just do my own video so people can find it here too but again i'm completely copying pen pen and his manipulation of the ai brilliant it's perfect okay this is very easy because uh i struggled a lot on this last night um okay so show no mercy that's that's it he's just gonna do show no mercy and uh uh his coup once. I think that was all. Um, let me see. Uh, one thing to note, I had a problem with this. First of all, you need uh, present bomb to be uh, ranked up relatively high. You need your present bomb um, and uh, your Nimzo to be able to take out the metal dragon in one hit. Not very hard. Uh, that is one of the few DPS checks here. I mean, it is a DPS check, but you'll see, um, his video, his, uh, Young Terry didn't even have the first awakening. Mine does. So, um, uh, you know, another thing, the, uh, awakenings don't screw anything up. You'll see, especially with units like Seraphy, sometimes... <laughs> Having the Awakening can screw a strategy up completely. I ranked up my Dual Magus, and none of the Door 25 videos uh, with Dual Magus would work. Trust me, I tried a lot of different things. Um, I could not get it to work. <laughs> uh, that is just one of the reasons I'm doing this. I'm not... I don't like the idea of stealing people's videos. So, anyway, hopefully I mentioned that enough times. I don't know. Ugh. Um, yeah. You might get a crit on that guy. So I don't know if Alina needs to stay down there. I know that he crit it, and he stayed down there anyway. Um, so you might need Alina down there just to get the AI to move. That is a really important thing on this map. You know, it's, it's, it's kind of easy to uh, not notice things like that. But yeah, where your units are may, may seem completely irrelevant in videos like this, but uh, it is important. You know, especially in this video, I mean, there's so many like there's so many good hits that you miss, but you need to stay out of range. You need the enemy to go to this spot and that spot and whatnot. So yeah, uh, applying envenomate on uh, the enemies that he can. I don't know if it's automatic or not. I don't remember if they're weak to it, but um. It is inconsequential. By the way, I remembered the strategy pretty fast. So I watched this video twice. I think a third time while I was uh, actually doing it. Um, so you'll see in Pen Pen's video, he got a crit here. My Elena is just stronger. So uh, even if I do get a crit here, you'll see that it was not necessary. There you go. I just, like, remember, you saw the coffin there. Okay. Uh, it, it, it was going to die no matter what. So, there you are. Uh, I guess the about the only RNG in this fight is uh, you need uh, you need to evade a couple of things. Oh, um, that's what I want. Yeah. Okay. Like I said, I remember the strategy pretty well. So, yeah, that present bomb is terrific. Uh, and, um, you know, I, I don't really read anything, um, but, uh, 
the damage, uh, what, what, it has a chance of raising their wisdom and attack, or it does it automatically. Uh, these guys are all breath and martial, so who cares? Like, present bomb is amazing here. I said, when I was trying this on my own last night, I was trying to follow a different guy that just didn't work, and this was starting to seem impossible. Yeah, that, that, uh, dodge there really helps. Uh, it's fine that they both took that hit. Well, you know, I think the only problem I had was when Sorrow took a crit there. He took a crit from that guy, and then, um, he got killed off by the ad. So, maybe it's just that you need to not be crit. Um, there we go. Do a big heal here. Dude, he haven't had his abilities uh, less leveled than mine. Uh, his Terry was rank 8, rank 7 rather, which barely matters. So, like I said, th this this guy just is amazing after I struggled for an hour or so last night. So, uh, if you're seeing, if this is the only 31, it, a lot of people are advancing a lot right now. And if you think this door is really easy, trust me, there are some steps here that you need to follow pretty closely. So, yeah, I, did, I didn't get any relevant crits here. Uh, my first clear, I actually got a crit with uh, Sorrow to take out the Forest Dragon early. So, um, this shouldn't matter at all. Are they still... Yeah, they're still buffed and all that, so... Um, just, just to be safe, I guess. You know, it doesn't matter. Sorrow's about to kill this guy, I'm fairly certain. Did I see? Oh, yeah, there we go. And, uh, you know, I love that attack. It can't miss. It's, wow, 3,000 damage. Oh, Terry is good. <laughs> so, there you go. Uh, like I said, this, this is pretty straightforward. Um, there are a couple of chances to get crit by the Forest Dragon. Um, but, you know, it's on evasion units, so... There's a... At that point, there's only a 40% chance, so... 60 to 40% chance of being hit. Like I said, I got one unlucky crit that killed my first run, but this is a, a really easy video, because the other ones all involve huddling up in the corner and being really careful and stuff. If you haven't done 31 yet, this is... A, I mean, I don't know. You might not have Young Terry. Sorry, not everybody has Young Terry. Everybody got Sorrow, right? I know not a... Look, the, the planners got Sorrow. I'm not judging anybody, but you should have Sorrow. Really good chance everybody's got Elena right now. She's fantastic. The the Robin Hood Santa dude was farmable. So is Nimzo. He's only four hearts in this video. Um, this is a video that uh, most people can do. Um, I don't know how many people got Terry. Maybe I'm being... Whatever. Uh, good luck, guys. Ask questions in the comments if you need to. Discord's in the description. Uh, check out Pen Pen's video. Uh, give him a subscription. Some of his guides are amazing. Um, all right. Good luck on your own, guys. I'll see you later.